Will ChatGPT replace Google as the primary search engine? This is the billion dollar question on everyone's mind ever since OpenAI and Perplexity announced their very own web browser. But the fact is, Chrome currently commands 66% of the market share. However, this wasn't always the case. Back in the 1990s, Netscape had the first mover advantage. So, to break their dominance, Microsoft bundled Internet Explorer with Windows. But whether it was Netscape or Internet Explorer, people still searched through Google. So, Google capitalized by launching their own browser. First, they controlled the query, then the browser, and finally, the mobile OS. And that's how Google won the first browser wars. Yet today, the biggest players in AI are building browsers again. But why? Simple reason. Data control. Browsers are where users live online. So, whoever owns the browser, owns the data. And in AI, more data equals better models, which leads to more users. But data control is just one piece of the puzzle. The other key factor is interface control. Traditional browsers were designed for human navigation, but modern browsers can now see your screen, access your calendar, and send emails on your behalf. Think ChatGPT, but for all things on the internet. That's why in this second browser war, the best AI browser won't look like AI at all. It'll just feel invisible.